It was the care that she gave them. It was the importance that she made them feel that made all the difference. How many people here think of themselves as a leader? Right now, I want everybody to stand up. Stand up in your seat. Go on, stand up. And I want you to say, just say it loud. I am a leader. Now I want you to look at the person next to you and say, you are a leader. And so that is exactly the role of a caring leader. The role of caring the leader is to let people know that they can overcome and, and jump over the obstacles, that they, what they do and where they're going means something to you, besides just like checking the box or achieving a goal. You are doing more for them to help them achieve more and be more. That's what caring leaders do. Thank you very much. You supported me. You showed me concern and kindness. And when you're in an environment like that, you don't want to leave that. You want to be there. Again, a retention strategy, right? Now, here's the thing. Caring leadership is not for everyone. And that is because we're imperfect, we make mistakes, sometimes have big egos, and it gets in the way of us seeing what do I need to do to meet the other person in their shoes. Now, I still won't be able to do that all the time, but more of those. <laughs> Thank you very much. Just a little bit better, right? Just a little bit better. Thank you. But I think it's more about quality, and I, I'm going to take back my lunch hour, and I'm going to come back a little fresh yes! in the afternoon. <laughs> Love it. But it is it's incumbent upon the caring leader to recognize the holes we're leaving for people who look to us for guidance, and then have a willingness to fill it and the stamina to see it through.